Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to another one of our uh, YouTube videos on our VKS channel. Uh, we're taking a look at uh, the new C&D helmets uh, for the 2023 season. Uh, we've got uh, two ranges here. We have the Balance and we have the Albion Z. We'll just run you through some, uh, some finer details and uh, take a closer look at these brand new helmets. So there are two, uh, two ranges that we've got here. Like I said before, we've got the, uh, the Albion Z. Uh, and the balance. Uh, the Albion Z is the one that you can see uh, where the top two helmets are just there uh, with the added ventilation and the balance is the entry level model uh, with still a good amount of ventilation as you can just see there and uh, both of them have a cloth covered finish uh, which is a single piece which wraps right the way around uh, the helmet. There are no joins uh, as you can just see and uh, available in titanium in the Albion Z as well as the steel and the balance as I said is the entry level model so just the steel version available there. If we take a look at the grill construction um, you can just see here the two fixed uh, the two fixed screws just there so um, with a new British standard that was introduced a few years ago there's no adjustments allowed to uh, the grill there's no uh, upward and uh, downward movements or if I can just angle the camera there uh, so it's fixed uh, the uh, the opening here is fixed. Uh, there's no changes. Sorry, there's no uh, adjustment allowed, and that's whether it's a Missouri, a Gun and Moore, Shrey, uh, whatever. That's a fixed, uh, the fixed uh, system, just there. And just coming on to the the balance, uh, it's exactly the grill, the same grill, the grill system on the balance as well. In terms of the uh, design and the finish. Uh, the uh, the Albion Z, as I said, is the uh, the two that you can just see to the uh, to the left of the screen. Uh, they come in a two uh, a two piece design where you can just see the uh, the plastic finish to the uh, the grill system and the halo that goes right the way around. I guess rather like uh, the Missouri Vision series, uh, but these ones are considerably uh, considerably lighter. Uh, the balance is the single piece construction, uh, as you can see, just see to the right of the screen there. As we take a, t uh, take a look at the inner, uh, the inner design to these helmets, uh, they've both got uh, a good amount of padding to them. You can just see the Albion uh, Z to the left uh, with the polystyrene, uh, the insert that goes right the way through as a single piece. Um, and then you've got a good amount of padding that's supplied with the helmet, different sizes of padding, which you can adjust according to what's comfortable uh, to you. On this particular one, we're pretty much showing you uh, the full range of padding that's supplied uh, and it looks good a nice uh, nice lime green and black color scheme which does look very very good and it is comfortable as well so you've got padding to the side uh, to the back to the front and uh, to the top as well so nicely padded which gives it a nice comfortable feel as we just come over here you can just see the balance again for an entry-level helmet fantastic amount of padding right the way around the mesh uh, the mesh lining and the padding right the way through and you can just see uh, the chin strap design as well and it's uh, exactly the same chin strap on both of these both of these helmets taking a look from the front um, to the left we've got the Albion Z in the steel to the right it's the uh, the balanced steel and just to the back it's the titanium so you can just see just a slightly finer finish to the titanium grill and a different color um, but it does make for a much lighter helmet. Uh, titanium stronger and it is lighter uh, but you know whichever one you go for whether it's a steel or the titanium finish you will be getting fantastic uh, levels of protection and a nice lightweight feel. Um, for most for most batsmen the steel one is good enough if you're there you know for a long time batting long innings uh, then yeah the titanium would be would be the one for you uh, but you don't really need to spend you know the extra amount uh, the vast majority of cricketers are very happy with the steel, uh, the steel finish. Taking a look at another angle, I just wanted to show you this particular angle so you can just see how well ventilated the uh, the Z model is. Uh, the balance to the right, as you can see, you've got three ventilation holes, but with the Z, um, they really have gone to town and it's all over, um, which makes for a very very comfortable uh, feel uh, during those long innings, especially when it's uh, hot during the summer or when you're batting indoor in the nets, you know, for long periods of time, that will make uh, a great difference to you. 
So thanks for watching this video. Um, the Albion helmets, the Balance and the Z shown here from another angle. Uh, but thanks for watching. Do subscribe to our channel. Uh, press like, leave us some comments. If you need any more information on these particular helmets, do feel free to give us a call. Pop into the store, drop us an email. We'll only be too happy to help. Try them on. Um, we do have the other models as well from Shrey, Missouri, Gunnamore, uh, Kookaburra. Uh, but these ones, uh, I do like them indeed. Thank you for watching. Take care.